Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's Antoinette from Simply Chic. In this video I am sharing with you guys some food recipes that are super delicious and super healthy. I hope you will enjoy and I hope you will give it a try. But before we start I want to ask you kindly to subscribe to my channel and share this video with your family and friends. It will help me grow my channel out and I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for all the love and support you shown me often we prefer to use fresh ingredients for our meals however when certain circumstances occur like pandemic hurricane or snowstorm we have to use what's in the pantry for meals i always try to have some vegan canned food and pantry ingredients stocked up and what you see here is what i have on hand you might have similar cans and staples in your pantry or maybe different ones use what you have on hand and cook some healthy that you will love first meal is this vegan tomato barley soup and here all the ingredients that I am using I will leave all the recipe in the description box below so check them out I'm gonna start off with cooking the barley first I added one cup of washed and rinsed barley with four cups of water bring it to a boil let it cook for half an hour or until it's tender Meanwhile, in another pot, I heat up some oil and saute some onions for a minute or so. Then I added the garlic, stir together, then add the spices, roast them a little bit, then add the tomatoes. Let them cook for a few minutes, then add the water. Bring it to a simmer for a few minutes, then add the cooked chickpeas and the cooked barley. I stir everything, then cover and let it cook for another 20 minutes. Next meal is called Mujaddara. It's traditional Middle Eastern dish. It's brown lentils with rice topped with caramelized onions. And here are all the ingredients that I needed for this recipe. In this pot, I am adding the spices with two bay leaves, then adding about four cups of water and bring the mixture to a boil over medium high heat. Once boiling, I stir in the lentils then stir in the rice and let the mixture return to a simmer. Cover and reduce the heat to medium low and cook until the liquid is absorbed and the rice and lentils are tender, about 20 minutes or so. Meanwhile, I warm some oil in a large skillet over medium high heat, then I add the onions, Stir it and let it cook. I keep an eye on it. Stir it every couple of minutes until the onions started to caramelize and started to crisp at the edges. About 15 to 20 minutes. Then I transfer the onions to the plate that I lined with some paper towels. When the lentils and rice are cooked, I turn off the heat and let it rest for about 10 minutes. Then I transfer the mixture to the serving plate and I top it with the caramelized onions like this. Last meal is also simple and full of flavor. It's mixed bean soup and here are all the ingredients. Again, I will start with heating some oil, then saute the onions, then garlic and spices. I add about two tablespoons of tomato paste. I stir it for a minute. 
then add the tomatoes. I let the mixture cook for few minutes, then add 4 cups of vegetable broth. I bring it to a boil, then I add about 4 cups of mixed beans. I used whole beans and I cook them separately, then I freeze them to use whenever I need. If you have canned beans, it's fine, use what you have. At this point, you can add some potatoes if you like, but I wanted it to be pantry meals, so I am adding half a cup of dry quinoa. I stir everything well and cover then bring it to simmer on a medium heat for about 20 minutes i let it rest for a few minutes then serve it warm i hope you enjoyed these easy vegan meals that you can make out of your pantry and for sure you can use some frozen vegetables or fresh vegetables that you have in your fridge but i just wanted to share with you guys how you can cook some healthy meals out of the cans and staples in your pantry Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you on my next one. Be well and have fun.